So my background is actually in engineering and I did my undergraduate degree in electronic and electrical engineering and my project there was working on a health application for children with a specific language impairment. So that kicked off the working in health thread um, that took me to do a PhD in looking at the use of mobile phone apps in healthcare, just looking at p patients with diabetes and cancer. And then from there I worked in primary care and public health, again looking at e-health applications. And then life brought me to Sydney working with the black dog, working in the mental health space. So one of the projects I'm working on is looking at whether we can measure patterns of social connectivity using mobile phones. And the idea is that if we can build up a pattern of someone's normal social connectivity, we might be able to detect when social withdrawal takes place, as this can be an indicator for depression or even suicidal behaviour. Um, so for this project, we've developed an app that can run on your mobile phone, and periodically that looks to see what other mobile phones are around about you. It's an indicator of the group of people you're around. And so by looking at what other phones and people are around you, we can build up this picture of the patterns of social connectivity. So we think this project might be able to help young people with depression um, when they're in, at the start of a decline, when they're starting to withdraw from the social circles a bit. So we don't know the best way yet of being able to help people in that situation, but we're hoping that by being able to detect when this happens, we want the track to being able to help. So this app is only available as part of a research study at the moment, so it's not available on the App Store, but we hope, if it is successful, that it will be publicly available in the future. So obviously, smartphones are becoming more and more ubiquitous. There's also a lot we can do with normal phones and uh, through the internet as well. So there's great scope for increasing the reach of programs in an anonymous form, there's also new things that we can deliver with technology that we just weren't able to before.